Taylor Swift's energy usually came from the crowd's roar, but tonight it felt far away. As a familiar face appeared on the jumbotron, the stadium lights became blurry. It was Travis, in the middle of his victory dance after scoring another touchdown. When their eyes met, there was a quiet talk that went beyond the cheers. But lately, all the rumors about their romance that were going around online were getting annoying. Behind the scenes, Taylor took a deep breath and grabbed her phone. The crowd's roar wouldn't be the only sound she made tonight. Her fingers flew as she hit a post. Travis, was the first word, and it meant a lot. Then there was a picture that no one else had seen. From their Vegas date, Travis, who was funny and cute, trying to sing, Love Story, at karaoke while she laughed and her eyes sparkled. When worlds collide, and it works like magic, the caption said, This man makes me happier than any song I could write. We're not perfect, but we are 100% who we are. That's it for now, my winner. When she hit, post, she felt a wave of weakness wash over her. After that, a lot of comments came in. Fans shouted in support, sick of all the attention from the media. Globally, hashtag Tavi Strong became a trend. Celebrities joined in with heart emojis and jokey congrats. Travis FaceTime call lit up her phone after the show. A shy grin broke up the serious look on his face that was normally filled with defiance. You know, he started, his voice rough from feeling, sometimes I forget that you're, Taylor Swift. You were just, my Tay tonight. She had tears in her eyes. And you, she said in a deep voice, are my Travis. The person who makes me laugh all the time, even when I'm writing a sad song. The bad things going on in the world faded away as they talked for hours. As dawn painted the sky, they hung up. They felt more united than ever. The world might not get why a pop star and a football player were together, but it didn't matter. Their love song was unique and only they could hear. It was strong enough to stand up to anyone. Taylor Swift's shows are usually powered by the crowd's roar, but tonight there was a different kind of energy in the air. It wasn't just another stop on the era's tour, this was Travis's hometown of Kansas City. She looked through the crowd with excitement as she finally saw a familiar red shirt with Kelsey 87 written on it. She had a big smile on her face, which sent a message through the crowd. Taylor talked to the crowd for a moment after starting a fan favorite. Instead of the normal jokes, she had a determined look in her eye. Oh Kansas City, she said, her voice clear, you've loved me so much over the years, and tonight I want to repay the favor. There was silence in the crowd. There's a special someone here who means the world to me. Travis stood there embarrassedly with a silly grin on his face as cameras flashed at him. The crowd cheered, whistled, and made fun of each other in a friendly way. Taylor laughed, and the sound was like wind chimes. Travis, she said, her voice getting softer, you've been my rock and biggest fan. You've been there for me through the late night studio sessions and the crazy tour schedule, reminding me of what's important. There was a low rumble of thanks from the crowd. He put up his hand. The tabloids may twist things and paint their own stories, she said with a sharp tone in her voice. But what they don't see is the quiet, funny side of us that they can't catch. The strength we find in each other. Travis and she locked eyes, and they made a wordless promise to each other across the room. This song, she said with a heavy heart, is for you, Travis. It's about love that goes against what you think will happen, the kind that makes you change your happy ending. The stadium was filled with the first sounds of a new song that no one in the crowd knew. The words to that beautiful song were honest and from the heart. They painted a vivid picture of unwavering love and support. When the song was over, the stadium went dead, and everyone let out a collective gasp. Then there was thunderous applause, which made Taylor feel very emotional. When she looked into Travis's eyes, tears filled them, and one of them ran down his face. In that moment together, under the bright stadium lights, they changed the story. Their love story became a strong song that would be heard long after the last note had been played. Travis Kelsey was used to hearing the roar of the crowd as a music. But tonight, even though there was all the normal excitement before the game, his heart beat in a different way. The Eras Tour made a big stop in Kansas City that night, and Taylor, his Taylor, was about to take the stage and rule it. 
the stadium went quiet as the lights went out. Then, a flashlight hit the jumbotron and showed a beautiful tailor bathed in an ethereal glow. There was a lot of attention, but it wasn't because of the sparkly outfit or perfect makeup. It was the way her eyes showed how she felt. As the music began, a hauntingly beautiful song played. Taylor sang about unwavering love and a connection that went against what people thought it would be like, not sadness. Some shaky phone videos of them kissing behind closed doors at award shows, a picture of Travis cheering from the front row at a concert in London, and a home video of them laughing on the beach were shown on the stadium screens. People in the crowd gasped and they saw the shy Travis with the big smile in the clips. He felt a wave of warmth that was a delicious mix of love and weakness. Following this, Taylor's words came through loud and clear. This song, she started, is for the man who showed me what real love is. Travis, you are my biggest fan, my biggest backup, and my loudest booster. You came into my life like a lovely tune, a perfect balance to all the chaos. You've accepted everything about me, the hurts and the shine, the loud crowds and the quiet nights in. There were cheers all over the stadium, and Travis felt a wave of love. He felt a tear roll down his face, which was an act of love that Taylor would have never seen coming. But being open and honest with her felt like a win. They told me it wouldn't work, Taylor said, raising her voice. That our lives were too different. Travis, you never saw the change, though. I know you saw me. It doesn't matter what else. We built this love, our love, on laughter, understanding, and a strong loyalty that knows no limits. The last line made a strong statement. To everyone who doubted us, Taylor yelled, this is our answer. Her eyes were glowing. Love like this is real, strong, and will last. It's not a fairy tale when I'm with you, Travis, it's a promise. As soon as the last note ended, there was a huge round of applause in the stadium. But for Travis, the only sound that counted was the echo of Taylor's love. It was a love that could be heard through the cheers and had won over the biggest stage and, most importantly, his heart. Taylor Swift often felt like she could feel the electricity in the room. But tonight, as the last notes of Love Story faded, she felt a strange knot in her stomach. A sea of phone screens flashed, but instead of the usual enthusiastic cheers, they showed a never-ending stream of question marks and broken heart emojis. For weeks, the media had been crazy, breaking down every look and every mysterious song lyrics to find signs that her relationship with Travis Kelsey was getting weak. There were rumors of a fight and a possible breakup that hung over her whole Gira's tour. That was enough. Taylor took a deep breath and strummed a sound that he knew well. There was a general hush over the stadium as the crowd calmed down. There's something I want to talk about, she said, her voice calm even though her heart was beating fast. The thick, waiting silence stayed. She went on, Travis Kelsey has shown me what real love looks like for the past year. Even when no one is looking, he's been my rock, my friend, and my biggest fan. A few rounds of praise were given, and the crowd felt a sense of relief. With a wry smile on her face, she said, the spotlight can be tricky. It makes the good thing stand out, but it can also change the truth. Some people see it as drama, but I see it as the beautiful, messy process of falling in love. The stadium lights seemed to dim as Taylor spoke, and her voice got lower and more personal. Travis is not just a prize or an award. He's not a song lyricist. He's the one who picks me up when I fall and makes me laugh until my sides hurt. He's back home. A loud roar sounded out, and Taylor felt a wave of real love. She held up her guitar and said, this next song is for him, for Travis, for the love that doesn't care about off-seasons, headlines, or drama. We call this, Enchanted. The first sounds resounded through the stadium with more power than before. She looked around the room with her eyes while she sang until she found Travis's in a private box. With a big smile on his face, he stood there holding a sign that said, forever enchanted. It was exciting again as the crowd cheered, but this time it was a celebration of something real. At that point, Taylor knew it didn't matter what noise was making. It didn't matter what the tune was, it was theirs.